see tech stack is a collection of three tires so one is the front end the second one is the back end and the third one is the database so all these three combined together makes a full stack so when a person says he is a full stack developer that means he can work on front end back end as well as with database it doesn't mean he knows all the technologies Hello everyone, welcome to this video on Month Stack by Coding Ninjas, myself Vishesh and I will be taking you through this video. In this video, we will talk about what is Month Stack and even what is this stack, right? So if you like our content, then stay subscribed to Coding Ninjas channel for more such amazing informational and educative videos, right? So let us begin our discussion about stack or tech stack. See, tech stack is a collection of three tires technology right so one is the front end the second one is the back end and the third one is the database right so all these three combined together makes a full stack right so when a person says he is a full stack developer that means he can work on front end back end as well as with database it doesn't mean he knows all the technologies it means he knows minimum three technologies that can be used to develop a full web application right so following this full stack our month stack works so let us first see about month stack in a brief so month stand stands for MongoDB, ExpressJS, ReactJS, and Node.js, right? So these four technologies make up this stack, right? So let us let us understand it in a little deep how Mern stack actually works, right? So on client side, on client side, our part of the Mern stack works. What is our our R is basically React JS, right? So on this on the client side, you users basically interact with the web applications right so on that side react js work which is a front end framework right while on the back end side where all the logics will run that is the node js right that is a server part on that part our node js runs right node js is a javascript basically runtime environment which is used to develop server server end of web applications right as as node.js is running on server there is backend frameworks there are backend frameworks like express.js which takes care of the request and response from the client end right now at the end of this stack there is a database which is a mongodb in in month stack see react.js needs to interact with the database right so it has to sh so see react.js basically render data now it can not directly interact with the database so there has to be a layer between them which is our backend layer right so we will see why this month stack is useful but before that let me tell you one thing if you want to do data structures and algorithms course right then there are amazing courses available on coding ninjas website these courses are available in c plus plus java python right so there are teaching assistants as well so if you want if you have any doubt then they can personally assist you in solving that doubt right apart from these these data structures courses there are development courses as well like web development app development machine learning data science so these are literally top rated courses in the industry so i would recommend you to visit the coding ninjas website at least one to explore such courses right so you can take trials as well and there are some discounts running as well right so now now let us understand why mern stack is a suitable technology let us let us see in depth about this each technology right so mongodb is a non relational database right which stores json data json data right and also it the queries in the mongodb are built on the javascript part see i am not here telling you why 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 mon stack is suitable i am letting you know about each and every technology and at the end we will see how why this mon stack is useful right so let us we have seen the mongodb right which is a non sql database right now let us see what is node js node js is a javascript runtime environment which is used to build server end of various applications right so node.js is used to build server end of various application and there is a express.js 
it is a node js framework that runs on the server side to handle so basically to handle server side queries and the responses express js is also a framework see express js node js these all work on javascript you must be noting this thing that these were these all work on javascript right now there is a front end framework which is react js it is again work it again work on javascript it runs on the client side to render the data and uh, to handle events like clicking on a button or a key press so it basically renders data and handle events on the client side that is the react js right so you can can you see all these technologies work on javascript so there is only one programming language that you need to learn to able to learn all these technologies right so you can develop a web application using this technology but using only one programming language javascript so it's a it's basically it's easy to learn one 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 reason second reason see so see there is there is necessarily some interaction between these technologies right so front end react js interacts with database right and it interacts with the back end part node js so when it interacts there is no switching of a programming language there is only a single programming language which is javascript so basically that communication delay is avoided so we are avoiding that communication delay so basically mon stack is fast so that's that's the reason why it is suitable to use monstack is very fast right so this is all about this video i hope you like the video and thanks for watching till the end right so for more such amazing content and informational education videos stay subscribed to according ninja's channel we will keep bringing such videos right so thank you guys stay safe and keep learning